Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve if you're coming across an error message that says an insufficient system resource exists to complete the API. And this says that this device cannot start, code 10. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now I will have a command in the description of my video guys. I want you to copy it and then go up the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit and then paste it in. It's going to launch the hardware and devices troubleshooting utility. So go ahead and select the advanced button and make sure it's check marked to apply repairs automatically. And then select next. I recommend following along with any suggestions it makes here. And then hopefully this should have been able to resolve the problem. You can see it did repair uh, drivers here. So at the close. And like I said, hopefully this should have been able to resolve the problem. If not, something else we could try here as well. If you open up the search menu, type in CMD. Best match, come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on it and select run as administrator. Select yes if you receive a user account control prompt. And now you want to go ahead and type in SFC all by space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run so please be patient. And once this is done, go ahead and close out of here and then restart your computer. And there you go, guys. So hopefully that was able to help resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.